Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 loses to the A17 Pro in new flagship smartphone battery test, showing obvious advantages of the 3 nanometers process. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 might be fabricated on a manufacturing process that is a generation behind the A17 Pro, but earlier multi-core performance results show it even beats Apple's 3 nanometers SOC for the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Maximum. Unfortunately, where it falls short is in the battery life, as one YouTuber shows that power efficiency is just as important as raw performance iPhone 15 Pro Max with the A17 Pro also ends up running cooler than the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, powering the Xiaomi 14 Pro. The Channel Tech Droid tested out several flagships in the battery life test, but two models that we wanted to pay close attention to were the iPhone 15 Pro Max and the Xiaomi 14 Pro, both armed with the best-in-class mobile chipsets. Both handsets were tested with the 120Hz refresh rate option enabled though it should be pointed out that the iPhone 15 Pro Max and Xiaomi 14 Pro are running at varying resolutions that cannot be altered. As most of you would have figured out, the Xiaomi 14 Pro also has a slightly bigger 4880 mAh battery, while the iPhone 15 Pro Max is equipped with a 4441 mAh cell. Despite this difference, Apple's top-tier flagship is the longest-lasting device out of the six tested, with a time of 11 hours and 54 minutes securing first position while also running cooler at 44.2 degrees Celsius. In second place, we have none other than the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3-powered Xiaomi 14 Pro, which lasted for 10 hours and 24 minutes. This year's Galaxy S23 Ultra, featuring the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 and its 5000 mAh battery, managed to close the gap with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 with a time of 10 hours and 5 minutes, showing that Qualcomm's chipsets are as efficient as ever, but not as quite as the A17 Pro. However, the smaller gap between the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 and Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 hints that the company might have had to pump more wattage into the latest SOC for higher performance, which may have negatively affected its efficiency capabilities and raised its temperature. In case you did not notice, we did not see the Dimensity 9300 found in any one of the flagships tested, and since it sports a unique CPU cluster that is void of any efficiency cores and mass-produced on the same N4P manufacturing process as the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, the results would have interesting. Perhaps we will see another flagship that becomes a part of this battery drain competition and provide more data for our readers. For now, the iPhone 15 Pro Max is the reigning king of devices bearing the highest endurance, but the Xiaomi 14 Pro did well too.